the horrifying crimes of Jeffrey Dahmer Vertical Bar True Crime Explained. Welcome to our channel. Today we delve into the chilling case of Jeffrey Dahmer, one of America's most notorious serial killers. Known as the Milwaukee Cannibal, Dahmer's heinous crimes shocked the world. Who was Jeffrey Dahmer? Jeffrey Lionel Dahmer was born on May 21, 1960, in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Described as a quiet and reserved child, Dahmer showed signs of trouble in adolescence, displaying a fascination with animal dissection and disturbing behavior. Early signs of disturbance. Dahmer's dark tendencies emerged in his teenage years. He committed his first murder in 1978 at just 18 years old, when he killed Stephen Hicks. Despite a troubled past, his crimes escalated drastically in the following years. Modus operandi. Dahmer's preferred victims were young men, primarily of Asian or African-American descent. He lured them to his apartment under false pretenses, promising money or alcohol. There, he would drug and subsequently strangle them before engaging in necrophilia and dismemberment. The horrific discovery. Dahmer's crimes went undetected for years until one fateful night in July 1991. Tracy Edwards, a potential victim, managed to escape Dahmer's clutches and led police to his apartment. What they discovered inside was beyond comprehension. Severed body parts, photographs of mutilated corpses, and evidence of cannibalism. The gruesome details. During interrogation, Dahmer chillingly detailed the extent of his crimes. He confessed to murdering 17 young men between 1978 and 1991. Dahmer's modus operandi included preservation of body parts and experimentation with human remains. Psychological evaluation. Experts attribute Dahmer's actions to a myriad of psychological disorders, including borderline personality disorder, schizotypal personality disorder, and necrophilia. His disturbing upbringing and isolation fueled his depraved fantasies. Legal Proceedings and Legacy Jeffrey Dahmer was convicted of 15 counts of murder in 1992 and sentenced to 15 consecutive life terms. While in prison, Dahmer was killed by a fellow inmate in 1994. His case remains a chilling reminder of the darkest corners of the human psyche. The case of Jeffrey Dahmer serves as a cautionary tale about the complexities of human behavior and the importance of early intervention in mental health. His crimes continue to fascinate and horrify to this day, reminding us of the enduring impact of true crime. Thank you for watching. If you found this video informative, don't forget to like and subscribe for more content on true crime and criminal psychology. Stay safe, and until next time.